I'm Paul Edmonds, head stylist on Brit's Next Top Model. And this is how you get the look. We're going to use the Volume uh, Shampoo and Conditioner by Show. And what that will do is give you the, the extra bounce to start. So we're going to make this a beautiful start by kind of get preparing your hair. What we want to do is get, create as much volume in that root as we can. So by using the correct shampoo to get that, it just makes life a lot easier for you. You're going to get the right result right from the very beginning. Now it's a concentrated shampoo so you don't have to use masses of it. So I'm going to use three pumps and then start to shampoo. Right, Ivy, we're going to do a soft wave braid. So we're going to wave the back just very softly and then bring a braid across and around on that front. So I'm going to use the, the show thermal protector and if ever you're kind of doing anything with your hair I'd always recommend using a thermal protector. It just stops any damage. Okay. I'm going to use a large barrel tong and I'm going to take vertical sections and what I'm going to do is starting at the root and I'm going to leave the ends out not really get too much curl onto that end otherwise it can end up looking a bit old-fashioned. Okay so we've gone right round the head what I've been doing is working in different directions so this last one I did forward this next one I'll do back and by doing that you get an uneven kind of wave so it ends up being kind of a so soft natural wave you can see that they've done in different directions so this one's that way this it'll just end up making it much easier to deal with. So if I put my fingers through it and shake, shake it out, it's a very natural, soft wave. So now I'm going to start on the braid at the front. And we're going to use a perimeter braid. So with a perimeter braid, what you do is you only pick up from one side. So I'm only going to pick up from the top and do it so it will lie quite low and onto the hair. You take that front section there, divide it into three, and then cross and cross. And I'm going to cross it again and now I'm going to pick up my next section from the top and instead of doing an ordinary kind of plait where you, you pick up from both sides and you pick up from one side. So cross, cross, take the next section. So when I get to the end of the braid I'm just going to pop an elastic into the end and keeping it all quite loose because again, you want it to look quite soft and sexy. Okay, so we're going to use a bit of show finishing spray just lightly in there, just to get the odd little bit. And there we go, a soft braid wave. It looks amazing. <laughs>